Right, we are looking at this uh, word problem in front of us, and uh, we are focusing on solving this word problem about uh, consecutive integers. And uh, we are told through this problem that we need to find three consecutive integers such that uh, the sum of the first, twice the second, and three times the third is minus 76. Full stop. Right. So how do we then solve this problem? Proceed to solve this problem step by step. So we let we let x be equal to the first the first integer. Right. And because they're consecutive, the next one is x plus one. So that x plus one is the second integer. Okay, and then now this x plus two, which becomes uh, the third integer, like so. Right, so we add these now, and this question says uh, we need to find uh, the sum, such that the sum of the first, twice the second, and three times the third is minus 76. So we find the sum of the first plus uh, twice the second. So it's twice uh, x plus one and uh, three times the third one, which is exactly x plus two. The result is minus 76. Now this means you have x plus two into x plus one plus three into x plus two is equal to minus 76, like so. Right, now dealing with these, then we have twice x plus two plus three uh, x plus uh, six equals uh, minus 76, like so. Right, upon further addition with x plus two x plus three x, and these here, give us what they give us exactly a 6x right and 2 plus uh 6 give us 8 and therefore we have minus 76 minus 8 okay and then we have 6x equals minus 84 right and uh, if you divide by 6 both left and right we obtain the following so we have 6x is equal to minus um, 84, so that now we divide the left by 6 and the right-hand side also by 6, and we have x equals uh, minus 14. Right, so that, so that the integers The integers are, right, they become x, x plus 1, x plus 2 as consecutive as they are. So that now we have uh, minus 14, minus 14 plus uh, 1, okay, and then we also have minus 14 plus two. So this is exactly minus 14, minus 13 here, and minus 12. Hence, we've seen that we have minus 14, minus 13, and uh, minus 12. Hence, these are the integers, right? Are the consecutive integers, right? Consecutive integers. Now, the couple of things so we need to, to consider at this point, right? Let's find the sum of this. Let's check. So if you do a check, of these, 
you would then realize that you need to find the sum of the first plus twice the second plus three times the third. And so let's see what we get here. We get a minus 14, we get a minus 26, and you get a minus 36. Right, and the sum of these is actually minus 76. And it's actually the sum that was given to us. And we are very, very excited about this. And uh, therefore, we can be rest assured that therefore that is the solution to the problem. And thanks everybody for watching and goodbye to you.